All right, guys, let's go to this LUT I just made, and it will be available for you guys to download for free, along with flat footage from this tutorial. So if you get the LUT, get the flat footage, you'll get the same results as this. I'm not sure how long I'll make it free for, though, so head over to my website, download it, guys, and get the same results as this. Let's get into this tutorial, and just a bit about this LUT, just really warm highlights. Those blues come out, and then those blacks stay very black. And just in general, I just wanted a really gold, old LUT and I was thinking of stripping out the blues for this but I thought I'd just keep them in anyway here's our first shot here if we just look at our before and after so here's our adjustment layer over all of our clips here's our LUT set to 75% so it's within color finale pro doesn't need to be in here but all that's in here is the LUT applied here and then I've just got this curve adjustment here so it just takes out a little bit of contrast by pulling down the midtones there, just sort of flattens out the image a bit, and that's it. So here's our LUT on and off. So if we just close Color Finale Pro, on and off, no adjustments to this clip, but you can see all those blues coming into the image because it's quite an underexposed image. This one, really warm on off. As for adjustments, I think I just brightened it a bit because it was a bit dark but that's about it there was no adjustments so exposure up and then i just had to bring the shadows down to keep a bit of contrast otherwise your image gets too flat over here really nice colors with lots of greens lots of warm greens um, again no adjustments to the clip itself i don't think yeah no adjustments there on off on off really gold greens as well they go really nice and gold especially in the warm shots love that before after for this clip looks like i just brought the exposure down put the whites up so if I reset that i could almost prefer it like that so no biggie there just sort of added in some contrast by bringing down the blacks in this shot before after really gold warm tones there Bang. I like the blues it shows in the shot with the real gold bar. Like that bar is like pretty much meant to be white. It's got a little bit of yellow to it, but it goes real yellow. And ours, the sky goes pretty warm, really nice yellow to it. And then those blues really come out as well. Uh, before, after um, the shot, nice and bright, real harsh light. And it looks like I just took out a tiny bit of shadows to flatten it a bit. I reset that, hardly anything happening there. The shot, no changes. For after. Yeah, really good on skin tones as well. So, uh, yeah, no changes that clip either. Hardly any changes to anything really. I think this clip was overexposed. So. Uh, whites down trying to take out lots of contrast while bringing down the exposure uh, let's try to find some different clips what's this one uh, no changes again but you can see those warm tones coming in uh, low light city shot this purples come out a bit as well here we have as you can see, those blues go really warm, like the aquas, the bright blues. They pretty much disappear into this really nice warm tone. No changes to this either. Pretty much just color correction. As long as your color is color corrected, it should come out good. That's a pretty cool shot. For after and adjustments none to that clip either. This one, this one, this shot's like underexposed kind of so just brightened it this shot was really overexposed but hopefully you guys get the picture that you sort of don't need to do much to it oh, this shot shows just the gold tones like the shot's already going to have pretty gold tones to it but the LUT just really brings it out and gives a real nice richness to it like I really like that those gold tones there so the shot no changes again just makes it extra golden and like a deep orange uh, this this has really nice colors so you can see the skin tones change from like a reddish pink to a real nice gold there uh, those blues warm up and then just all those really nice tones 
Uh, yeah, and there's all the clips for the ones you just saw. This one, so I wanted to use this one just as an example. This is like the sliding setup. So this LARP, this is a very dark shot. So there's no blues in it. And this is the whole idea, the gold, dark, blue LARP. Those blacks go very black. And then, uh, yeah, obviously those gold rich tones that you can see in the skin tones there. But yeah, I wanted to show this clip because those blacks go very black. Didn't really show you in that intro. Again, not much color in those blacks. So if you get a dark image, you're gonna get a very black blacks. And then just another shot here like this. It just really shows those gold tones and then those blue tones coming through. Uh, another one that really emphasizes the blues there. So turn that on, it's gonna really bring out some of those blues. And yeah, I'm just gonna leave it there. And yeah, that's about it for this one, guys. Honestly, I probably prefer to do video stuff, but I'm just so busy on my course at the moment for photo editing. But video editing and photo editing, when it comes to contrast and color, are virtually 99% the same. So if any of you are interested in color grading, I definitely recommend the photo editing course I'm working on at the moment. I'm teaching how to work with the curves, how to get the style you want, and to make good LUTs. It comes down to making good presets in Lightroom to make good LUTs. Uh, we just hit 100k so that's kind of why I also want to give this away for free because it's been like three years maybe two years two years and a bit. Give me some ideas of videos to make down in the comments guys and I'll catch you in the next one.